Krobum, I think he shall be spawn 1987-88 is a lawyer and soccer agent. In 2009, she became the first South African female FIFA-accredited soccer agent. In 2007, she was a founder of the sports management company P Management. Mathing Tishabuse was born in Orlando East, Soweto, South Africa. Her father works in economic development for the city of Johannesburg. Growing up, Mathing Tishabuse lived three houses away from Jomo Sono. She attended her first soccer match at the age of five, and frequently attended soccer matches with her now husband Josie and Nonsanta Nkosi, who later became marketing manager for Kaiser Chiefs. Mathing Tishabuse decided to give up playing soccer during high school. Mathing Tishabuse has a bachelor's degree in media and international relations from the University of the Witwatersrandwitz, and in 2014, she began a law degree at Wits. Mathang Tishabuse has two children. She is now a practicing attorney of the High Court of South Africa. In 2007, Mathang opened her sports management company P Management with her now husband Josie and Nonsanta Nkosi, marketing manager of Kaiser Chiefs. The company was set up to scout amateur soccer players for those who had talent to play professionally. Her company has scouted players including Amanda Dilamini. Tendai Endoro, and Ronald Kampamba. Enkosi left P Management in 2012. Whilst applying to be a professional soccer agent, she had to pay Roe million of indemnity insurance to the South African Football Association SOFA, using money that her company had made. In 2009, at the age of 21, Muthang became South Africa's first female soccer agent to be accredited by FIFA and SOFA. She had previously failed the soccer agent's examination twice. In 2015, Muthang Tishabu set up the Association of Accredited Agents in order to try and solve the issue of unlicensed soccer agents in South African football. As a soccer agent, Muthang Tishabu has represented Justin Shonga and has also worked with the Binkosi Lodge. In 2013, Mathang Tishabuse was listed in the Mail and Godian Young South Africans.